Tired of manually adding subtitles in your movie edits? Spending hours syncing every line? Not anymore. Today, I'm giving away something that will save you tons of time. An After Effects script for generating auto subtitle in your movie edits. And the best part? The script is 100% free and easy to use. You will get the script from my Discord. Link is in the description and it's free to join. So here's a tutorial on how you can install the script. So you will get the JSX bin script file from my Discord. Copy this file and go to your drive C. Then Program Files, then Adobe. Adobe After Effects, Support Files, Script, Script UE Panel, and then paste the script in this folder. Now your script will be installed in your script UI panel. Now you'll be wondering how to use this script. Don't worry. I will show you step by step how to use the script and features of this script. So add your clip in your composition. So I'm using the Avenger movie scene for this tutorial. The argument scene between Captain America and Tony Stark. Big man in a suit of armor. Take that off, what are you? Genius billionaire playboy philanthropist. I know. So now to use the auto subtitle, you need to have the SRT file of the movie you are using for the edit. And it's very easy to get the SRT file. Just type the movie name on Google. For example, I'm going to search the Avenger subtitle SRT download and download from any website you want. It doesn't matter. Just make sure it should be .srt file. After downloading the file, click on Choose Cert File and select the cert file you have just downloaded. So after that, you need Start Keyword and End Keyword. So listen to the dialogues and type three to four words in to the Start yeah. Keyword. Big man in a suit of armor. And in End Keyword, type three to four words where you want the subtitle to end. Playboy philanthropist. I know guys with none of that worth 10 of you. I've seen the footage. Choose word per caption, like how many words in one line. So I like four words per line the best. So I'm choosing that. Font size is default 48. You can change and select auto line break if the word's too long for the composition. And you can also add custom preset. And I will tell you later how to add your presets. Then you can change color of text and also add stroke too. Just select stroke color and enable stroke and also specify the width of the stroke too. And then just generate your subtitles. As you can see, the subtitles are generated. Let's see how our subtitles are looking. Yeah, big man in a suit of armor. Take that off, what are you? Genius billionaire playboy philanthropist. I know guys with none of that worth 10 of you. I've seen the footage. The only thing you... So let me tell you how you can add your custom preset. Select all your text effects and you can either save animation presets from After Effects or you can also copy and paste your ready-made preset into the folder of the script. Now the default location of the script folder is document greater than Motion Caption Pro and paste your preset or save them into the folder. You can restart your After Effects or remove the script from the panel and add the script again. This will refresh the script. So the added effects will be shown in the dropdown and you can generate your subtitle with any effects selected. If you don't see the Motion Caption Pro folder, just go to Edit, then Preferences, then Scripting and Expressions, and then allow this circled setting. And restart your After Effects. Subscribe my YouTube channel. And that's it for the video. Bye-bye.